During your clinic visit today, your blood pressure was elevated. This suggests that you have high blood pressure, also known as hypertension. While this is a one-time reading, it doesn't tell the whole story. But it is an alarm that suggests you have high blood pressure at other times. The problem with hypertension is that it puts you at risk of future stroke, heart attack, kidney disease, memory loss, and other serious complications. These life-threatening problems are caused by the long-term excessive force of blood against your artery walls, which eventually damages your blood vessels, including those of the heart, brain, kidney, and elsewhere. You can have high blood pressure for years without ever having any symptoms. But even without symptoms, damage to blood vessels and your heart takes place. It happens gradually over time, without your knowing about it until more serious damage occurs. That's why checking and treating hypertension is so important. The higher your blood pressure and the longer it goes uncontrolled, the greater the damage. High blood pressure can be a silent killer. Until a time machine is invented, we can't go back in time to undo the damage. So take your readings very seriously. So what can you do now? Most importantly, talk to your doctors and other healthcare providers about your blood pressure, including the provider you're seeing today. If you're seeing a specialist, it's important that you also let your primary care doctor know that today's blood pressure was too high. How do you know if you're at risk? For many adults, a reading above 140 over 90 is harmful. But for some, above 130 over 80 is unhealthy. Your healthcare providers can help you determine what your target blood pressure should be. If your blood pressure is high, it's important to check it often and record your numbers in a journal. Then, share them with your doctor. In fact, make sure to check it today when you get home or at a local pharmacy where this service is free. If you don't have one, it's recommended that you buy an inexpensive blood pressure cuff so that you can regularly monitor your heart. Now is the time to be proactive. Lifestyle changes and medications can decrease the risk of health complications. Exercise, a healthy diet, and weight control are natural treatments for hypertension. But your doctor may also recommend medication to lower your blood pressure. The bottom line is you need to work with your team of healthcare providers, especially your primary care doctor, to control and manage your blood pressure. Otherwise, you can invent us all a time machine and we'll worry about fixing it when we return from the future.